Hey, did you know that 84% of the U.S. population are licensed drivers? Would you like to know a few fun tips about the tires that take you there? Welcome to Emily Talks Tires. Let's jump right into a quick breakdown of what all these letters and numbers mean on the sides of our tires. The first three digits are going to be the width of our tire in millimeters. So this particular tire is 245 millimeters wide. The second number will tell us our height of our sidewall, which is 45% of the width. Z means it's a high performance tire and R means it's a radial. And the last two digits are our wheel size. This tire is made for a 20 inch wheel. This next series of numbers and letters is our load rating and our speed rating. This particular tire is 103 load rating, which is pretty high. There's another indication of exactly how much weight this tire can carry opposite down here. We'll show you that in a second. This Y indicates that this tire has been tested up to 186 miles an hour with that much weight. Pretty small on the tire is our max inflation number. A little known fact, the max inflation pressure on our tire sidewall is not actually the pressure that we want to run in our tire. We need to refer instead to our owner's manual or the door jam on your vehicle to find the recommended tire pressure. Underneath that, you'll find max load, which on this particular tire is 1929 pounds. This is a really good one to know. These four digits here are our date code. The first two numbers are the week that your tire was produced and the second two numbers are the most important which is the year that your tire was manufactured. Hopefully you learned a little bit about what all those letters and numbers mean on the sides of our tires. We use them every day. There's no way to get around that we all have to purchase tires. If you need some for your vehicle, jump on ContinentalTire.com and we'll get you fixed up. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you next time.